Welcome to JSA TV, where we're covering the latest stories, trends, and innovations from leaders in digital infrastructure. I'm Buffy Harakidis of JSA, and joining me today we have Jeff Ferry. He is a board member at Alia Data Centers. Jeff, welcome back. Ah. Thanks for having me back. It's, uh, it feels like a continuation from our last interview at, at IDW. It does, so, yeah. Uh, appreciate it. It's always great to be on stage with you guys and, and to talk about what's going on in Alia. Yeah, from National Harbor to Cannes, yeah. here for Data Cloud Go Global Congress, the 20th edition of Data Cloud Global. Uh, such a big milestone for them, but let's talk more about Alia and your big milestone and exciting news about the Rio AI City and its. 1.5 gigawatt yep. uh, investment there in Brazil over the next decade. Can you tell us more about this initiative and what it means for the future of AI in this emerging region? Yeah, it's fantastic. So, so literally, when we were at ITW talking about Alia and talking about like you know sustainability, uh, Alessandro, our CEO, was in the West Coast with like the mayor of Rio, with the finance minister, with. You know, a lot of folks from Brazil visiting with a lot of like with the video with with a lot of the hyperscale cloud, uh, you know, people and launching and discussing this AI city. So it's been a great partnership with and and, and, and agreements with the city of, of Rio, the mayor and the staff and the group of like, you know, really helping, you know, put all this together and helping uh, develop Rio as a primary city. Right. As well as well as partnership with Electrobras and the team there and, and uh, you know, kind of allocating and helping, you know, like knowing that there's going to be power there. So it's not just an announcement of hopefully someday being at a gigawatt. Right. We have available power today and now we are, we're just executing and, and need to kind of then, you know, plan and, and, and produce and, and just execute on the plan. So it's, fan, it's, it's, it's very exciting times at Aaliyah. It is very exciting times. I mean, Talking about Rio, yep. another beautiful destination, by yes. the way. Uh, what makes it an ideal location for the development of Rio AI City, and how will that location shape the project over time? Yeah, so the starting point is, like uh, you know, as I mentioned, this partnership and the cooperation and the vision of the mayor of Rio, of the Rio City, of like the other components of like a, a, you know electricity, of like helping bring it all together, as well as obviously our uh, you know our. Our CEO with Alessandro living there, you know, headquarters is there, you know, really trying to focus on, you know, Rio being like an AI city, a destination point and development around it. It's not just the AI city, it's development of the port and and kind of a a reestablishment of Rio. You know, one of the key points is that there is a substation, you know, a, a subsea cable landing station there. So you have connectivity, you know, from Rio up to the Fortaleza from Rio to you know Miami and to the Americas to Europe to Africa, so it has you know key you know kind of connection points there in Rio that help establish it why it makes sense to you know as well as the support of the government. The other thing with with and we've talked about this before with Alia with Brazil is the amount of available power. It's all you know it's it's ninety five percent green power, right? There's available power in the grid already. It's like it's already produced, and so. It, it 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 checks all the boxes yeah. of why would you go to you know like Brazil why would you go to Rio uh, in, as part of that you know working with not only the local government but the national government and the finance minister uh, they recently announced a um, an AI initiative and a, a compute initiative to relieve some of the import duties on compute equipment so what was normally or formerly maybe a 40% tax on some of the import of, of some of these equipment that's been relieved. And so it makes the project that much more palatable from an outside standpoint of bringing GPUs in. So the work with NVIDIA, the work with the hyperscalers, it's like, you know, it's been a lot of conversations, a lot of like, you know, development that, you know, Alessandro, Julia, uh, our other board member, uh, you know, working with the government, working on just educating them of like the importance of having this AI city. It's, it's a lot of work, but uh, it's, it's good to see the, the, yeah. the results of the work, right, coming together. So A lot of work, but much needed work, yes, right, yeah. uh, to enable AI and, and all of its capabilities in that emerging region. And Ali is also known for sustain its sustainability-focused yeah. mission, obviously. Uh, how will that fit into your vision for Rio AI City? Yeah, it, 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 uh, I, we don't have pictures of it, but I wish we did. It's it, like the design... 
you know, is, is supposed to capture kind of the Rio history of like being, you know, more, uh, you know, the jungle, the forest. Yeah. So it's very green, you know, green skin, you know, on the, you know, to reduce the temperatures to, you know, hold, you know, to and um, to really develop, you know, like an engineering. So like from the beginning, right, engineering and designing it, you know, from a sustainability standpoint, you know, being uh, focused on water usage, right, and, 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 and as well as PUE. So everything, you know, like when you can, the best thing about it is like when you start it, when you create it, you can kind of start with that in mind and then design around, you know, like making sure it's most efficient as possible, mm -hmm. you know, with like with scarce resources, right? Like, right, like you know, with water, with, you know, kind of how, how you cool it, you know, how you, you develop it. So um, then, you know, like Brazil's always been that way, right? It's like it's, you know, with the fact that it's like, you know, 95 percent carbon free power, you know, it, 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 it has a lot of resources. And, and, and that's the benefit, I think, of like being there and, and being able to work with them. So uh, it, it, as you can tell, it's a lot of fun working with the group and, and they're just great people. It's a great company. Uh, they really Brazil, are. We were, yeah, we were, we're just about chatting before. about it. And, and, you know, and we're, uh, you know, like we're focused, right? We're only in Brazil. People ask, hey, do you expand? It's like, there's a lot to do. And as you can tell, like just even the AI city, right? And so I think that focus helps, um, you know, not only the, the culture of the, the company, you know, we're Brazil. Uh, we, we, you know, we have in, lo local investors with, with Brazil, work with the local governments, the national government to be able to kind of like promote Brazil more than promote the company. So that's it. It's, uh, you know, look forward to it. You know, have uh, a lot of like uh, work to be done, right? Because when you announce a project like this, then you got to you got to follow up and you got to do it. So like, we putting got, Brazil we on the AI data center map for yeah. sure. And where can viewers go if they want to see those pictures? Uh, I, and the website more. for Alia Digital, for Alita Data Centers, I think is probably the place to go. I think some of them are on there. If they're not, we're going to have to put them on there because I just <laughs> committed to it. So, uh, I, so we'll, we'll we'll have some of this on, on. And I think some of it has been also posted to LinkedIn and, and some of the announcements of like because not only did we announce it, but the mayor of Rio, the like you know the finance minister. So like there was a really really productive meetings when they went to the west coast like uh you know when, when we we're at iqw they, they yeah. were actually they, that's why our sounder couldn't go there so uh you know a, a lot of work's gone into it so like it's good to see some of the some of the results definitely yeah. yeah well i'm glad to hear all these exciting developments this is the last time we spoke in rio uh, for rio ai city and thank you so much for joining us again good for another again. episode of jsa tv yep. thanks for all that you're doing uh, to put Rio on the map and all of the sustainability initiatives uh, that Alia Digital is doing. And thank, thank you. you viewers for tuning in to another episode of JSA TV live from Data Cloud Global Congress here in Cannes, France. Happy networking.